Hello, thanks for tuning in. I have a lot to share today in the UFO community and some recent developments in the news that I believe are worth sharing. Starting off, we have a group called the Sky 360 Project that is building a worldwide network of automated cameras to keep watch for strange aerial phenomena. This group consists of developers wanting to take the control out of the hands of the American government, who has been anything but honest with sightings since the Roswell incident in 1947. This project will blanket the Earth in affordable monitoring stations to watch the skies 24 7 and even plans to use AI and machine learning to spot anomalous behavior. With the group's commitment to transparency, this will be open sourced, so check that out if you have time. Meanwhile, in London, Sunday, during the coronation of King Charles, a photographer captured what he believes is a UFO. Simon Bolson said, I was shooting some photos from the 13th floor of my apartment building in Limehouse while the Red Arrows did their flyover. The Red Arrows are the aerobatics display team of the Royal Air Force. Simon went on to say that he had no idea what the object was, saying activity in sightings has increased in the East London area. I enhanced the image and tried to increase the spec to see what it was. It looks like a floating acorn or something, Simon stated. What do you think? Is this extraterrestrial? Finally, Demi Lovato, who is, according to the Daily Mail, an award-winning singer and songwriter, shared some several photos to her Instagram stories, showing an unidentifiable object in the sky over California desert near Palm Springs. So, here are five videos that are making the rounds this week on the internet, starting with a submission on TikTok by user Alexi NZ. A very impressive camera zoom on this video. The TikToker zooms in on the moon, revealing what looks to be several different objects around the moon's orbit. What starts off looking like one, a smaller object appears from below. If only we could get smartphones to have this level of capture utility. This video comes from Costa Rica by the YouTube channel UFO Room, captured in the vicinity of the Juan Santa Maria International Airport near the capital city of San Jose. If you watched our last episode, a pilot captured a similar object some 30,000 feet above Colombia, also very similar to the testimony given by a retired Navy senior chief petty officer given during a Senate hearing over an orb spotted in 2022 in the Middle East. Very interesting. From TikTok user Challenger Reality, we simply have a two-prop plane, thousands of feet in the air, and quickly passed by a strangely shaped object. It's hard to gauge the size of the craft, but it does look to have a diamond belly with perhaps a dome on top. What do you see? There's a traffic light. What's going on up there, huh? What is going on up there? This video was captured in San Diego, California in March. Not much else is known. It does seem to be several objects that fade in and out of the clouds. Also very interesting. What is that? Those aren't birds, that's way high. I'm zoomed in as far as I can go. something white in the sky up there. Let's see if we can zoom in on it. Dubbed the MUFON yeah. case, this footage was filmed in the Ozark mountain range in 2015. Oh, there it is. A group of hikers spot a bright white sphere fixed in the sky. The object would eventually disappear into clouds several minutes later. You can see the entire 13 minute video yeah, clip on Facebook UFO at side. UFO Slow Exposure. Well, thank you all for watching. And I just want to ask you the audience, is this something that you would want to see more of? 
as a new channel that wants to inform the viewer of ideas and the unknown, we would love any feedback. Thanks again, and we will see you soon. Okay, we have a white disc in the sky up there. Possibly a drone, but it's not moving. Could be a drone, possible. I'm I'm focused in as far as I can go.